All right, guys. You know I gotta make this video, but this Dead by Daylight, bro, is officially a pile of fucking dog shit, bro. This game sucks, assholes. Um, and here's why. First of all, these toxic cheating survivors, and not only that, it's already a fucking dreadful time to play killer in this game, bro. Between cheaters, between people coordinating together and communicating. Is a killer, dude. You're already stressed out. Almost everyone I know hates playing killer. They don't like playing killer. I uh, am now starting not to like playing killer. And, you know, once this game pretty much teeters off to the, like, nobody wants to play killer, all these toxic survivors are just going to go play another game and this game is going to die. That's exactly what's going to happen to this game right here. All these toxic survivors that are playing and are the cheaters that are playing here, they're just doing this to just mess with people. And it sucks, dude, because I have to play killer and I have to sweat my balls off just to try to get a win when I'm not even trying to do that. As a killer, I sh it's it should just come easy to me to be able to find survivors, kill them, have a good time. But no, it's the opposite. I have to sweat, sweat, sweat. And these survivors aren't scared of me, bro. They're in my face. They're just flashlighting. They're just fucking with you. And it's going to start teetering off to that point where it's unenjoyable for killers for survive for killers what's a hundred percent it already is i know a lot of people that hate playing killer i'm starting to hate playing killer i see why now um i'm still gonna play it though you know just just because why not but if dead by daylight doesn't fix this they if they don't start catering to killer side and making it stronger making like some better killer perks some like you got survivors that can just vault through windows two windows and fucking just loop you for days bro where you can't do anything you got these gen spreads that are three miles apart bro you can't do shit with these gen spreads it's just all these things factor in for the killer having a shitty time then you're one person trying to fucking watch a ton of gens and then you find somebody and you're like oh i'm gonna try to get a hook that person just fucking you know they just give you a terrible fucking time loop you and then but actually you no know, five gens three gens have gone bro these good survivors can do two to three gens and literally like they can do it so fast by the time you start looping one person they're already done there's nothing you can do so th this game for killer it's teetering into terribleness bro it's teetering into fucking uh, dreadful you know dead by daylight you started making a cool horror game now it's just becoming toxic survivors versus one person that's what this game is. It's toxic survivors versus one person. And I, I hope it changes. I really do. I mean, I, if, if it doesn't change, I don't see any hope for the game. I see it actually dying. I'm not going to put any more money into this game. I, I really am not. Um, it's, it's just getting to the point now where I, I just don't enjoy playing killer anymore. And I'll, I'm still going to play killer, but I just don't enjoy it, man. I really don't. It's it's a terrible it's terrible bro. The game is not balanced whatsoever, and that's facts. Anyone that thinks so, um, keep playing. If you think it's balanced, just keep playing, keep winning, get your MMR um, to the max, and then come see me. You know, after you've gotten so many toxic survivor matches, dealing with these talk. Even 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 if you win, these guys are still so toxic. You still don't enjoy the match, and you still had to sweat your fucking balls off just to win. And by the end of the match, you're just like, God damn, that was so much work, bro. It's just not enjoyable. As a killer, it should come easy to find people and kill them. They should be scared. The survivor should be scared. The pressure should be on them. Instead, it's the other way around. The pressure's on the killer. The survivors are the ones that are fucking putting all the pressure on the killer. And I agree with a lot of other YouTubers, man. They're leading towards this direction, and I see why. It, it really, the game really is taking a bad turn, and it's only going to get worse. These developers of Dead by Daylight clearly don't play the game right, or they just don't play the game at all, I, I guess. At higher MMR. I have no idea. But um, as money wise, I'm not spending any more money on this game, like for cosmetics or nothing like that. I'm done with it until it gets better. I'm not going to do it, bro. Anyways, that's just a little random mind, guys. I'm just fucking, you know, trying to play the game, like chill. I'm not trying to play sweaty. And it's just a terrible fucking time, bro. I can't even, like, it's just terrible, bro. I'm getting these toxic, sweaty ass survivors. And I'm having the most miserable time of my life as killer. But anyway, so hope you guys enjoy the video. Let me know what you guys think in the comments.